Hello, in this presentation, I'll show you how you can interact with smart contract using Etherscan. Any smart contract, you can interact using this interface. For this demonstration, I'll use any temp uh, temporary smart contract. Authority. This is just for a testing demonstration purpose, but it applies to any smart contract you want to interact go to contract address so basically this is the interface this is the contract address for any smart contract and if you scroll down go to contract section and in here you see all information about the smart contract you can read about it it's self-explanatory now to interact with the smart contract there are two ways one is read contract one is write contract read means you read all the read only information from the smart contract it doesn't cost any guess and write smart contract where you actually do the transaction you perform a transaction it will cost you guess to do that now to read transaction you can read all information for instance whatever is stored in the smart contract you can read it so these are all the information let's say i want to check this is a token contract so let's say i want to check a balance of this particular wallet address so i just put wallet address and query so this is how it will give me the response of whatever the information is stored in the smart contract and perform all kind of operations to read data all right so you, you have to just put uh, whatever the input field that you are supposed to put and then you can query for the data that's the read contract now let's talk about write contract if you want to write contract do some performing transaction go to that section first thing you have to do is first click on connect to web3 click on that so it will open up for permission it will connect the metamask address wallet address with this interface and let's say i want to perform this transaction i want to approve let's say i want to approve this particular wallet and the value i want to approve is one whatever and click on write that's it it will open up a metamask prompt just authorize the transaction and it will be done just click confirm there you go in here you will see the view your th transaction you can click on that button it will take you to the etherscan transaction page while the transaction is confirmed see all the information is being done and as you can see this is pretty self-explanatory it cost the gas used by this transaction is 26,000, and the ether was cost using this uh, each transaction fee is this much so this is how i mean you can just get all information about the transaction this is for any uh, kind of function that you want to perform let's say for instance if you are owner of the smart contract you want to perform owner only functions then also the same thing this just go to any particular function and then just do it now whoever is logged into this metamask wallet if he's admin or owner of the particular particular uh, contract then and then only he will perform this transaction otherwise they will not so um, yeah that's it so basically this is how you can interact with the smart contract right on the smart contract using etherscan if you have any question please comment down the video thank you